So here we have a two liter of spray. We're going to shake it to create more pressure and then we're gonna put lava on it. The lava is ready. We're going to take it out of the oven. It is very hot. The bet is launched. Who thinks that the bottle will explode? The temperature needs to be higher than 1200 Fahrenheit to melt. Let the experiment begin. That was a big reaction. Look at those balloons. Look at all those mantas. This aquarium can hold 10 gallons of liquid. We are going to fill it with Coca-Cola. It means that the aquarium can hold 37 liters, so 18 bottles of 2 liters of Coca-Cola. So we're gonna put all this Coca-Cola in the aquarium. We decide to add vinegar to increase the chemical reaction. We add soap so that it will create more bubble when the baking soda and the mentos will mix with the coca-cola and the lava. Look at, at all this coca-cola. Mix with vinegar and soap. So now we're gonna start making lava. This middle that you see right here comes from a ladder that we cut in piece. Now we have baking soda, balloon of mentos, it's just starting to melt, you can see the red as it gets hotter. Whoa, look at this, it seems like it's all melted gonna add others we need more lava it's look like a soup let's start the experiment you want to put the balloon inside so so he's gonna take the lava 
put it inside and he's gonna take the baking soda and put it inside inside at the same time. Look at all this metal. It is now transformed into lava. Whoa. Look at this. Wow. Whoa, look at this. Do you think the aquarium is going to break? We hear noise, it seems like... We hear creaking, there's a good chance that the glass is breaking. It takes time, I guess. Let's touch it to see if the Coca-Cola is hot. Oh, that is hot. We see the liquid flowing below the aquarium. I cannot wait to turn it over to see the damage that the lava has done. It seems that the Coca-Cola was not enough to protect the glass. Oh my god. Look at this. The lava destroyed the aquarium. Wow. Now that the aquarium is broken before throwing it to the garbage, we will test to see if a pellet gun can pass through the glass. Let's see. Okay. We have our confirmation it went through easily. Look at those holes, they are big. For the next experiment, we will try to make a giant elephant toothpaste. We need to stir the liquid well so that it mix with the peroxide. When the liquid is going to touch the mentos, there will be a release of heat. This reaction is going to create a lot of elephant toothpaste. It can even break the aquarium. Let's see. As you can see, we, we inflate a balloon and fill it with mentos. Let's start the experiment. Whoa, it's starting to heat. You can see the smoke escaping. Now let's see if the glass will break. It is strange. The green color that we put at the beginning has disappeared. The reaction has not stopped for several minutes, it looks like there is an infinite foam.
Okay, for the last experiment of the day, we put Orbeez in a balloon and we are now going to explode it. To make the explosion, we put special ingredients in the Coca-Cola bottle. By stirring it, the liquid will mix and blow up the bottle. I hope you guys are ready to see what's gonna happen. Now let's see the explosion in slow motion.